Wondering how to set up author tracking in Google Analytics so you can track the page views and get detailed data about your blog's authors? Well, in this video, I'm gonna walk you through exactly how to do that and how you can find and customize those reports in Google Analytics. So let's get started. Unfortunately, Google Analytics does not set up author tracking by default. Now, to sort by author in Google Analytics, you're gonna to have to add author as a custom dimension. Now, that means that you'll have to edit the tracking code and set it up manually. But thankfully, if you're using WordPress, I can show you an easy way to set up author tracking without touching a single line of code. So keep watching. Using author tracking in Google Analytics, you can discover the most popular authors of your blog. You can see the total of sessions for each author. You can find out which of your author's posts are keeping visitors engaged and on your site a lot longer. Plus, you can see which author's posts are driving conversions and a whole lot more. Monster Insights allows you to easily connect your WordPress site with Google Analytics, both Universal Analytics and GA4. That way you can see all the data that matters most right on your WordPress dashboard. And with just a click of a button, you can set up sophisticated tracking features such as event tracking and e-commerce tracking. Plus you can easily track forms, custom dimensions, outbound links, media, and a whole lot more. To get started, you'll need to install Monster Insights. Be sure to choose the license level that has the features that you're going to need, or you can just get started with our light version from the WordPress repository. For this tutorial, we'll be using Monster Insights Pro. So let's look at how to install Monster Insights Pro on a WordPress website. First, you'll need to head over to Monster Insights pricing page and select Monster Insights Pro. Now, once you're all signed up, you'll need to go to your account area and then head over to the Download tab. And once you're there, you'll need to download the zip file of the plugin to your computer. Next, log into your WordPress site. And then on the Admin sidebar, click Plugins, and then select Add New. And then click the Upload Plugin button at the top of the page. All right, now you can either choose File or just drag and drop the zip file here and click Install Now. Once that's done, just activate the Monster Insights plugin. Okay, now you'll need to connect Google Analytics 4 or Universal Analytics or both to your site. Now, don't worry, just follow the steps in the setup wizard and the plugin will automatically add Google Analytics to your site without needing to edit any code. If you'd like more details, be sure to check out the link in the description to our guide on how to add Google Analytics to WordPress. All right, once you've installed, activated, and connected Monster Insights to Google Analytics on your WordPress site, it's easy to install the Dimensions add-on. Just go to your admin sidebar, then to Insights, and then to Add-ons. Once the page loads, click the Dimensions add-on and click Install. Now you'll need to add custom dimensions in Monster Insights. Now to do that, just navigate to Insights, then to Settings, and then click on the Conversions tab. Now you'll need to scroll down to find the Custom Dimensions box. Now click into the drop-down and select Author as a dimension type. Monster Insights will then automatically save your changes. All right, now this next step is only for those of you who are using Universal Analytics. So if you're using GA4, you can skip this step. Okay, so now that we've set up things in Monster Insights, we'll need to set them up in Google Analytics as well. So to do that, log into your Analytics account. Next. Click on the Admin tab in the left panel. Now click Custom Definitions and then Custom Dimensions. Then you'll see a table where you can click the plus New Custom Dimension. Now in the Name field, enter Author and click Create. And you don't have to change any other settings. Then click Done. Now if you're using GA4, you can also skip this next step. So this step is to make sure that the index number in Google Analytics matches the custom dimension ID in Monster Insights. So first you'll need to check the index number for author in your Analytics account, and then go back to the custom dimension settings in Monster Insights. And then all you have to do is just make sure that the custom dimension ID matches the index number in Analytics. If it doesn't match, then all you have to do is just type the correct number and click Save Changes. Now Monster Insights will automatically begin tracking the different authors on your site and display a sessions report right inside your WordPress dashboard. Now you can see the report by going to your admin sidebar and then to Insights, then to Reports, and then just select Dimensions at the top. 
Now you can see the most popular authors that generate the most traffic on your site. All right, to get even more data about your authors, you can use GA4. Monster Insight sets up a custom dimension for you, so you'll be able to use the author dimension in custom reports without touching a line of code. Now, to see those metrics, you'll need to build a custom exploration report. Now, if you've not done that yet, you'll want to be sure to check out the link in the description to our handy guide on how to create custom reports in GA4. All right, to get started creating a custom dimensions report, you'll need to go to your analytics account and then to the Explore tab. Once the Explorations page loads, you'll need to start a new custom exploration report by clicking on the blank template. Next, give your report a name. Now you'll need to select and import your dimensions. Now to import dimensions, click on the plus button next to dimensions, and then either use the search function or the drop-down menu and click on the box next to each dimension to select it. So for this report, we'll be selecting author and page title. Now, once you've chosen your dimensions, just click the Import button at the top right. Next, you'll need to select and import your metrics. So, click the plus button next to Metrics, and again, you can either use the Search or drop-down function to locate each one. Then, click on the box next to each metric to select it, just as you did before. So, in this report, we'll be using Views and Conversions. Once you've chosen all the metrics you need, just be sure to click the Import button at the top right. Finally, click and drag the Author Dimension into the Rows box. And click and drag the Views metric into the Values box. Now you have a report of authors sorted by page view. To break down the report even further, you can try dragging the Page Title Dimension into Rows and drag the Conversions metric into Values. Now you'll see which pages belong to each author and whether those authors and pages led to any conversions. Now to access the author tracking data and search by author in Universal Analytics, you'll need to create a custom report by navigating to Customization, then to Custom Reports. In the Report Content section, you'll need to specify your preferred metric group. So in the Dimensions drill downs, add Author as your dimension. Then click Save. Now this is going to show you a custom report with Author as a primary dimension. You can customize your traffic report by choosing Author as a secondary dimension. So in Google Analytics, you'll need to navigate to Behavior, then to Site Content, and then to All Pages. Now click on any primary dimension, for example, Page Title. Then choose Author as a secondary dimension. This is going to add the author column to the report that you're looking at. And after you're all done, you can sort the order, change the view, and even export the data into a spreadsheet. And there you have it. In just a few steps, now you know how to set up author tracking in Google Analytics the easy way. With Monster Insights, you get the website stats that matter. See why over 3 million websites are using us. If you're not already using Monster Insights, there's a discount link in the description. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials, explainers, and helpful content just like this. We'll see you next time.